Question number one says, a weight lifter lifts a 310 newton set of weights from ground level to a position over his head. A vertical distance of 1.75 meters. How much work does the weightlifter do assuming he moves the weights at a constant speed? So here's what we do. We, um, we know that work equals force times, uh, times distance, so we'll say change of x. Work equals force times change of x. We know that the change of x is 1.75 meters. We're, uh, we're assuming that it, we're not taking into account any movement in the x direction. We're only taking into account the up and down movement. So a total of 1.75 meters and change in the y direction, and we're discounting our change in the x direction, and we know that the force was 310 newtons. So, simply uh, 1.75 um, meters times 310 newtons equals 542.5 joules. And by joules, what we mean is um, kilograms times meters squared per second squared. That's basically what we have done because um, force is um, kilograms times meters per second squared and we multiply that total by meters so it's kilograms times meters squared per second squared that's what a joule is so either unit would would be the same thing and since it wants the answers in joules um, it's it's just gonna be that number 542.5